Former Coronation Street actress Victoria Akanoi was welcomed on to ITV daytime show Loose Women on Wednesday afternoon. The star spoke about her ongoing breast cancer fight, sharing her experience of undergoing a double mastectomy. Victoria revealed she was diagnosed after spotting an alarming sign while breastfeeding her newborn baby Theo. Chatting to the Loose Women panel, Victoria described the emotional moment she realized something was wrong. The former soap star explained she noticed a lump in her breast when she was feeding her newborn son. She said, when my breast was full with milk it would just protrude out of the skin. I could see it, my partner could see it and it's quite alarming, the actress confessed. This morning Fury as guest claims Zuma backlash is over the top having seen some of her family members go through breast cancer in the past, Victoria was quick to get the lump checked at the doctors. She said, I'm the fifth person now in my family who's developed breast cancer, so I guess it's the experience of it. Plus, I'm patron of Prevent Breast Cancer so I've had to read up so much about it and learn so much, she explained. After getting the lump checked, Victoria was diagnosed with an early form of breast cancer called ductal carcinoma in situ, where milk duct cells turn cancerous. Shortly after receiving the heartbreaking news, the actress made the decision to have a double mastectomy and reconstructive surgery. When asked how her road to recovery was going, Victoria explained, think the hardest part for me has been telling people. She told the Loose Women panel she is now at the point where she will have to choose whether to undergo chemotherapy or hormone therapy treatment. Victoria revealed she is leaning towards the latter treatment over a five-year period as she was keen to avoid chemotherapy if possible. You're doing it again. Kirsty Alsop called out by co-star, watch Emmerdale twist as Laurel Thomas is arrested for fraud? Spoilers Ben Shepard teases tipping point player over Duran Duran admission, must see, as people know, the side effects of chemotherapy and the long-term effect on your life that it can have can be quite debilitating, she explained. However, she did note that the hormone treatment also could cause side effects. Victoria went on to explain how her son, Theo, gives her the strength to fight the cancer. He ultimately has been the light at the end of the tunnel for us, the actress remarked. Victoria described the birth of her son as an amazing, incredible, miracle and insisted Theo had become her driving force. We're a bit fragmented as a family because my partner's business is in France, so we're not together as much as we'd like to be. So, when we do get that time, it's so precious, so everything we're doing is for him, Theo, and we will do absolutely everything even if chemotherapy ends up being the best choice, so be it. Lose Women airs weekdays at 12.30pm on ITV.